Welcome to iDrive SoCal, the podcast all about mobility from the automotive capital of the United States, Southern California. Tom Smith here, and today we're reviewing the 2018 Volkswagen Atlas from our friends in the Los Angeles suburb of Ontario, California, Ontario Volkswagen. 2018 is the first year for the Atlas, and VW definitely did this mid-sized SUV right. I recently took one for a half-day test drive and was seriously impressed by many aspects of the vehicle. When it comes to trim levels, the Atlas really offers something for everyone, with 12 different options, including the following. The Base S model, starting at $30,700. Then there's the V6 S. Next, you have the Launch Edition with 4Motion, the V6 S with 4Motion, the V6 SE, the V6 SE with 4Motion, the V6 SE with Technology, the V6 SE with Tech and 4Motion. Then you have the V6 SEL, the V6 SEL with 4Motion, and finally, the top of the line, V6 SEL Premium with 4Motion. And that starts at about 46700 So price-wise, between the base model and the top of the line, you go from about 30700 to 46700 Again, something for absolutely everyone. As always, the prices we quote are just estimates. You need to select the Atlas that's equipped to your liking, and your price will reflect that. But you definitely want to go to Ontario Volkswagen to do so. Ask for our friends Randy Helcom or Scott Reed, and they'll hook you up. Lucky for me, I got to drive the top of the line Atlas, the V6 SEL Premium with 4Motion. Now, there's one option that my test driver didn't have, and that's the R-Line appearance package. The Atlas is a great looking SUV as is, but if you're looking for something just a little sportier or bolder looking, the R-Line dances it up nicely. The R-Line gives you 20-inch alloy rims, a grille that's a bit bolder looking, and some nice accents on both the interior and exterior. Not a big price increase, but like I said, definitely dances up the appearance nicely. The first time I spotted the Atlas on the road was somewhere on La Cienica near Culver City. I remember the situation vividly because at first glance, I swore I was looking at an Audi. I also recall the situation vividly because we had just started the iDrive SoCal podcast and I immediately called Professor Kwan to tell him about my first road sighting of the new VW offering. Of course, the professor excitedly rattled off all kinds of stats about the vehicle right off the top of his head, including the five-star safety rating from the National Highway Transportation Safety Board and the industry-leading six-year, 72,000-mile bumper-to-bumper warranty. Anyway, at first sighting, I thought the Atlas looked fantastic, bold and rugged, yet classy and refined, with great clean lines. The Atlas I drove looked even better. Again, I drove the top of the line. Now, it's technically a midsize SUV, but as we've discussed in many podcasts, everything is getting bigger lately, and the Atlas follows suit. From the outside, it looks a bit bigger than a midsize SUV, and inside, it's huge which is awesome, and we'll get to that in just a second. But what I loved about the Atlas is that while it looked and felt bigger, it definitely drove like a midsize SUV. It was highly maneuverable. I swung by the Bass Pro Shop during my test drive, and navigating the parking lot was not only a breeze, but fun. I was surprised how easily I slid in and out of parking spaces. The Atlas offers a great drive overall. Maneuverability was awesome, whether I was at parking lot, neighborhood, or highway speeds. I was very impressed at how sure-footed the vehicle felt. Very, very stable underneath while delivering plenty of power getting on the highway and passing other vehicles. The Atlas offers a ton of optional safety features, including pedestrian monitoring, blind spot monitor, rear traffic alert, adaptive cruise control, park distance control with maneuver braking, parking assist steering, lane departure warning, overhead view camera, and high beam control. All these safety features are great options with your family in mind. And not only is there plenty of space for your family, but that space is very well thought out and designed for ease of use functionality. 
The Atlas offers a highly versatile second and third row of seating for you to carry up to seven passengers. And this third row is not just for kids. Even adult bodies fit comfortably in the Atlas's back row. Plus, VW has solved the problem of getting adult bodies into the back row with the brilliant design of the Atlas's easy-to-move second row seats. Even better, that second row of seats is designed to move just as easily with not only a child safety seat attached, but without adjusting the child safety seat at all. One more aspect of the Atlas's second row of seats, it fits not just one or two, but three child safety seats. And you don't have to use seat belts to secure any of them. There's three different pairs of child safety seat anchors, which I absolutely love. If you've ever had to secure a child safety seat with a seat belt instead of the anchors, you know exactly what I mean. So let me lay out a scenario. I'm driving, my wife is in the passenger seat. We've added a couple of kids to the one we already have, so our Atlas's second row is loaded with a total of three kids, and they're all in their safety seats. But that third row is still back there and easy for adults to access. What a perfect location to put the in-laws. Great design, Volkswagen. I really love the way you think. One more really cool thing about the Volkswagen Atlas is the optional second row captain's chairs. So if you don't have a family or the need for the full second row of seats, then the captain's chairs can add a great and completely different dimension to the vehicle's use and passenger comfort. And all the space the Atlas offers isn't just for people. When you fold down the seats, you're left with a flat surface and huge 96.8 feet of cargo space. The Atlas really delivers with optional creature comfort technology too. The top of the line that I drove had it all, and man, was it fun and easy to use. I love Volkswagen's new digital cockpit. Instead of the traditional instrument cluster, digital cockpit displays information in digital high resolution. Plus, you can customize and save up to four different digital cockpit displays. And between the digital cockpit and the design of the touchscreen on the center stack, the Atlas technology was just super easy and intuitive to use. I was able to hop right in, drive, and use everything without much introduction. Other elements of the top of the line Atlas that I drove that I have to mention include huge moonroof, seriously, it was almost the length of the entire vehicle, hands free rear lift gate, just give it the old air kick and you're in, plenty of USB ports throughout to keep everyone entertained and plugged in, and speaking of entertainment, Fender premium audio system. And that's not Fender meaning car part. That's Fender meaning guitar and amplifier company. Nice. Delivered great sound. The ability to use Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Always love that. And it has a 5,000 pound towing capacity. Lastly, how can I possibly forget? Optional heated and ventilated seats. Okay. With all that, it's going to be tough to pick just three, but here goes. Top three. Number one. That new Volkswagen six-year, 72,000-mile America's Best Warranty. Even though VWs are known to last forever, the peace of mind that that warranty delivers is a huge factor. Number two, the interior space and versatile functionality. So many convenient seating and cargo options to go with. I just love that. Number three, the tech. VW's digital cockpit is huge. It definitely takes the driver vehicle interface to the next level. Overall, the 2018 Atlas is a great addition to the Volkswagen lineup. It's perfect for around town, a family road trip, or even a buddy's road trip for, say, a weekend in Vegas. And boy, am I overdue for one of those. And special thanks to our buddies at Ontario Volkswagen. Earl and Scott Reed, Randy Halcom, Jim Straley and Service, and the whole crew. Thanks, fellas. Be sure to stop out and say hi to the guys and test drive an Atlas. They're just off the 15 in Ontario, California and at OntarioVW.com. For iDrive SoCal, I'm Tom Smith. Thank you for listening.